Today I'm going to show you how to add a shutdown button to Windows 8. It's really something they should have made a little bit easier to access. So uh, what I'm going to show you how to do is to get one right here or to add it to the desktop or both. Uh, so what you have to do is just go to the desktop and then right click and there will be an option here that says new and click on shortcut. Uh, then it's going to pop up with this box here and here you just need to type in shutdown and then a space and then a forward slash that's the slash that leans to the right uh, and then the letter P so shut down forward slash uh, shut down space forward slash P and then just hit next and then you can change the name like you can hit shut down you can type in shut down button or whatever this part doesn't matter it's the last part that does matter so you can just hit finish after you change the name and then as soon as you double click on this it will shut down the computer so I'm not going to demonstrate it for you now, I'll demonstrate it at the very end, but uh, once you have it here, if you also want it to show up on this screen here, then just go back to the desktop and right click on the uh, thing you've created, and then just say pin to start, and that's going to put it on your metro screen. So if I go back to the metro screen here, then now you can see that that shutdown is there. And if you think that looks a little ugly and you want to like jazz it up a little bit, then you can also right click on it and go to properties and then go to change icon and it's going to pop up and warn you and just hit OK and ignore it uh, and then you have all these different icons to choose from you can even get more icons online if you feel like it but uh, like this one looks pretty shutdown-ish so then you should just like select it and hit apply and then you can see that now the shutdown button looks like that I don't know if that changes the look on here it doesn't look like it so uh, but and that's in general how to create a shutdown button on Windows 8 you could also just put the start button back uh, using a program called Classic Start. I go over that in a different video tutorial that I will link you to. But uh, just now to prove you, to you that it works, uh, I'll just double click on shutdown right here and you'll see that it shuts down. And there we go.